Hello, my beautiful Scorpios. Welcome to August readings. August energies, Sun, Moon, Rising Signs, and Venus. Today we're looking at three major beautiful events hitting towards you. For some of you are already there, for others of you are on the way. So let's take your Scorpios. What do we have for you as well? Now that could be just one event yours, could be all three. If you are willing to put it there for the situation you are dealing. As you know, everyone has to deal with certain things or are dealing with certain things. So let's begin and see. The first event, the second event and the third. And we'll put them accordingly. So we'll start with the first event that is here for you. Okay, one card already jumped. So it's your Queen of Cups. So there's something here about certain things here definitely regards whatever event is showing up will be pretty quick. For some of you, you gotta think pretty quick should you allow it or you should not. For others of you, maybe on the emotion level. And for others of you, could be regards whatever you need to do next. Eight of Cups, Temperance and Queen of Wands. And underneath we have the Hierophant. Some of you might deal here with uh, Taurus, Virgo, Pisces, uh, and Fire Sign, uh, Aries, Leo, or a Sag. And Temperance we have here. The Eight of Cups speak about the Chariot, Eight of Wands, and Two of Pentacles. So some of you, whoever you are dealing, I have also the Cancerian here, Sagittarius twice. Whatever here, whomever needs to make a decision to move forward, they will. So many, many of you, this event, it's about a decision of movement. And the Two of Pentacles, Ten of Wands, yes, somebody here is is going to leave a burden behind and move away from whatever was hard. Could be a, a institution, a work situation. For others of you, could be um, a marriage situation. Either you are walking, either they need to walk away. Somebody here definitely needs to put an end of something and move forward. It's like a decision needs to be made. I feel here this decision could start even in the July and will be at the most in September. The temperance energy, we have King of Pentacles, Moon, Three of Cups, and Knight of Wands. For some of you, yes, somebody here might come back for you or for this person, but it seems here it doesn't go. So if you were afraid of someone going back to someone or choose someone over you, I feel here they're not going to choose that person. Okay? So this event really speaks of don't be afraid. Let the things to flow the way they need to flow. Because even though whoever comes here to reunite or not is not going to happen that reunion so if you want to reunite with someone they might not want to reunite with you vice versa if someone want to reunite with you it's not going to happen that reunion okay and this also refers for those who do have already someone you know probably not set in stone or you start dating and I feel here someone will definitely hear about someone coming forward. But it seems here that you both will go different directions. Could be you, could be the person you might be dealing. Yes, somebody here is not up to anything out there. So for that reason, it seems here that somebody will choose what is stable for them what is good for them, 
what brings them stability, not what doesn't. And for some of you, yes, yeah, somebody here will walk away for good from a third party. So speaking of movement, it's here. And again, there is no more back and forth or maybe yes, maybe no. Somebody here choose their own thing. Absolutely. And that's beautiful. Yes. And also, I feel here for some of you, this is a money situation. And somebody here doesn't need to be afraid to have money or to, to doubt that they can't make money. Because next to the devil, I was like, let me find the devil, it's Wheel of Fortune. Somebody here will definitely have a very big, humongous increase of finances and will feel unreal even. And the devil with the, the wheel, it's kind of like um, a massive movement, but it's kind of to the increase of finances. And somebody here doesn't need to dwell too much into this. You know, you probably win some kind of money or you win a very great sum of money, but don't need to waste it because, you know, whatever is too much is not really good. So someone here definitely needs to know that. You see here nine of wands, six of pentacles and ace of pentacles. There's something here about you got to know how you can work through this or how to manage this but yes a situation here is gonna be behind or someone will put a situation that either doesn't work either is not giving anything behind the second major event coming towards scorpio this month we have five of pentacles Ten of Pentacles, Lovers, and Queen of Pentacles, and Two of Wands. There is a decision here that will need to be made. And I feel here the decision is towards healing. Somebody here will need to make a decision based on a conversation or after a conversation. This could happen around the full moon in Aquarius. There's something here about, I know this is for our own best. The lovers, king of cups, five of swords, six of swords four of swords and the hermit i feel also that somebody here needs to look deeper into the matter of fact for some of you could be a, a family situation here could be a money situation that is resolving or it's getting in a better energy or in a better way Somebody here needs to be much more patient. There's something here that before you make a decision, think throughout. Think throughout. Somebody here definitely will make a decision that definitely will bring the success into the things. Whatever that decision is. But I feel here the beginning to understanding that decision will not be a pleasant one. For example, someone here could make great money and now they don't. And they make a decision to leave the job they have and apply for other jobs. And somebody here feels like, you know, why you do that? Is this truly what you want? Some kind of yes. I feel here someone is done playing certain games or done to to be burned out there's something here about burn out do i really want this 
but soon enough someone will understand that this decision was to the best. Because we have the Hermit next card, we have a Tower moment. So it's kind of like suddenly I can see who I am and what I'm here and where I need to go. Okay? And what I leave behind. You see here this Five of Cups. Somebody here is just kind of like done to be in the losing situation or done to be in the past. Whatever does work, whatever does not work. And I feel here this is some kind of conversation or some kind of argument with someone. But someone here will feel like, you know, they need to do what they need to do to make things work. Whatever that things work is for. So this is quite um, a situation regards movement. Somebody here, whatever they do is because they... They can stay in a situation they don't feel welcome or good. Okay, and the third event coming and is manifesting for you, Scorpios. Three of Swords, Two of Swords, Ace of Wands, and Death. And three of wands. What I'm feeling here, this event speaks about clearing out unnecessary stuff, clearing out things that you you feel like you can't or you have no idea how to. And it's kind of more likely focusing on the new and whatever excites you. There's something here about bringing yourself to life. The Three of Swords, King of Swords, Two of Swords, Ace of Swords. Clearly something gotta go. Whatever that thing. I feel here for some of you, you might change your job. For others, for others of you, you are making major things. Regards a contract of any kind. But it seems here that you are crystal clear. You don't want to deal or want to do anything less than whatever it is. Five of Wands clarifying the death. Yes. Work-wise environment changing. Either you are not at the same page with your boss or with whoever you're working or people, whoever it is. I feel here you you could put in effort, but it's not really appreciated or is not seen the way it needs to be seen. And the Ace of Wands, yes. For some of you, you are going to go towards a new job. For some of you, you are going to whatever previously you've done or you start something new, which definitely feels like, you know, my work much better absolutely so it seems here you are giving yourself a chance to look into other things but yes i feel here you are clear bell in regards to the situation here and even though someone here might try to change your mind you know clearly it's not what you want to invest your energy or even your life too. So I see you distancing yourself from something. But it seems here, wherever you are going, it's more, it's much better or it's much more appreciated for the skills you have. So this is really, really touching here for some of you. Because having here the death and the other, which is the first major, and the second one is the fool. So something here you will clear out completely and moving into something new. I also hear for some of you, if you are in a divorce process, I definitely see here a contract with your lawyer. There's something here you're not going to deal any longer because no matter whatever you do, it's not going to work. So definitely someone 
that is in the film needs to work. It's kind of like you are removing yourself from this place going to a whole new place. And it seems here whatever it is, it's pretty quick. A new adventure, a new person for some of you. But I see here for many, many of you, it's a whole new adventure work-wise. Well, speaking about adventure, it's not really an adventure, but seems like an adventure. If you are leaving a job for another one, feels like you, you definitely want the new and the best. But I see you much happier out there. You know this is for the best. That's what I'm hearing. So whatever you do, loves, or whatever event speaks to you, let us know in the comments. And that being said, Scorpio, thank you for watching. Blessings. Namaste.